Hello everyone and welcome back to generation 20 of our A Life is a Game challenge. And today we are going to be diving in and seeing if we can finally become a streamer or a musician or a firefighter or any of the jobs that we have been trying to have our young babies end up growing up and having. It seems we have just a chain of, of a family legacy of very unsuccessful doctors and surprisingly successful teachers. Features. So I don't know where generation 20 will take us, but I do know I am excited for generation 20 because it will mark like a big milestone and it also marks a time where hopefully you guys will be able to see some new life simulators showing up in the near future. Just saying, it turns out there's a few others out there that I'm quite interested in going ahead and exploring. So let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to roll the dice and then we're going to see what generation 20 and possibly generation 21 are going to be. And if we are are going to be able to finally end up becoming a streamer. I think that would be fun because you know I do YouTube as my living and I have done it for almost 10 years but I forget how hard it can be to get here and that's kind of ridiculously reflected in how difficult it is to max out all of your like athletic points and all of your music points while you're in school. Oh my gosh but we'll see if we can manage it with the family this time. All right Dice of Destiny says it's a little girl. All right, so we've got a little girl. I think we've got the cat. Oh, she oh, she wants to be a police officer. Okay, hopefully that means that she'll have plenty of athletic coins in school. So maybe we're gonna make her really athletic and we're gonna dive after all of the athletic like classes she can take and all of the music classes she can take. All right, we'll go ahead. We'll let her be a little bit kind. We'll let her have, we're gonna definitely have her be creative. Smart, I think, is optional at this point because I want her, yeah, and definitely have her playing video games, definitely have her be super creative. I don't think we need to worry too terribly much about her being like super duper smart because uh, she's not going to study the books, even though I studied books. <laughs> like, if you want to grow up and be a YouTuber, um, well, I have a lot to say about that, but oh, come on, music, music, music. Okay, music, 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 music. Come on, jump, jump, jump. No, I missed a whole bunch of them because I didn't have her jump in time. I got so distracted by friends. Oh, she does need friends. All right. Okay, 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 okay. Come on, come on, music. Come on, music. Oh my gosh. Ugh. I need to be careful. Getting her too distracted by all the friend groups. Oh, no, no, I needed her to jump just one more. I just needed one more of each. I... I have a lot to say about this. I have... Oh, get that, get that. I have a lot to say about this. She did really not well as... as I just... We just needed one more of each. And because I got distracted looking at friends and missed the ability to jump a few times... Even that little girl doesn't pay attention to us. We don't have any money. <sighs> Life can be hard, but all right. Nope, 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 we're gonna perk it up. She's on the bus staring out the window and she's thinking how she's really gonna turn things around. She's got a fantastic friend group. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna keep our heads up, keep our heads up. We're getting kind of sad, but She's got a great heart, and she finally met somebody, yay! I don't think we've ever married this guy before. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, so she's got somebody. She's trying to get back into her hobbies and sports. Here we go. We're going to go ahead. We're going to turn everything around from here. Spend a lot of time with our husband. We've got a family on the way now. How excellent is that? Here, we'll go ahead. He seems like he's got a really great job lined up for him in that suit of his so we'll let him go off to work and we're gonna really find fulfillment and happiness we're gonna turn everything around yay all right huge happiness bonus yeah it looks like he's got a decent job we're doing all of the laundry all right so life it can be you just have to make what you can of life all right and we've got a bit of a rebellious teenager but that's okay we're still really happy together. We can afford a modest little house because we didn't do very well at work. 
<laughs> so saving when you're young is so important. And we're just, generation 20 is just gonna do their best to pass those lessons on. Look, we've got a great family. We have a nice, modest little house. Cheese Louise. Our health is not the best. So we're gonna try to get better health. No! Oh, we outlived our husband. All right. We're gonna pin all of our hopes on the last generation we've got coming up here, guys. All right, we're gonna wait until maybe our hobby can, maybe if we get really into like, I don't know, old person soccer. Uh-oh, uh-oh. All right, we gotta get out of here. Yes, all right. And then there is our grandbaby, adding a little bit more happiness to our lives. I noticed there weren't, oh my gosh. I noticed there weren't as many like abilities for her to to read books and just spend some time happily with herself this time around. And in the past, we have had a lot of the people born into our home who have tons and tons of books at the end of their life. So I wonder if you can influence. This is important. I'm like taking notes for like, okay, if I want to be able to have tons of books to read and be super happy in retirement, I kind of need to start working on things and thinking about things now. Oh my word. At least we had a lot of friends and family. We were a homemaker. If we had saved a little more money when we were young, we could have had the really fancy house too. Oh, it makes me want to go through and like balance my budget. We enjoyed playing soccer. We were so considerate towards our friends. We were the sweetest to our family. All right, see, you know what? She sat on the bus, super depressed after a bad day at work, wondering if she'd ever find love. And she told herself, life sucks right now, but I'm going to make it better. And she did it. And I'm so proud of her. Oh my gosh. That was really quite hard though. So all of you throughout my life, I was so thankful. See, she just really focused on the positives. I can't imagine, imagine how surprised that little baby would have been. He couldn't even talk yet. Oh, we lived a fitting life. Okay, so she had a good time, but still it's probably better than not having a house, right? And we, we had a good life. I was not very good at being a mom, but in my heart I always wanted to do better. Oh, see, I think she would be the kind uh, of person who would end up... Uh, thank you for spending your life with an idiot like me. No, be positive, be positive. I really think she would give the boost to the, maybe the homemaker, because we've had so many homemakers. And we got distracted by friends, but I mean, she lived a fulfilling life. I shouldn't say distracted by friends, but it, I guess you could end up, when you were young, you were so lively, small and cute. Oh, you could end up really easily distracted. All right, we were so close. We were so close. Oh, we got what? She just had like a random reward. Oh, you guys, okay, okay. Oh my gosh, we have enough points. Okay, okay, we're gonna do it. We're gonna come up and we're, if she loved soccer, we're gonna spend all of these on the soccer balls. Could this be it? All right, it says a daughter. So generation 21, will we finally, finally, finally manage to make this happen? Will we finally manage to grab all of the music classes and all of the sports classes? And, and be able to make my dream of having a little streamer baby who can just like tell the story. She's gonna, she's gonna become like maybe a podcaster or something and tell the story of her family's legacy. That sounds so perfect, doesn't it? We'll have her focus on kindness and creativity. We can grab a few smarts while we're at it. Kind, kind, definitely need to practice games. Definitely need to practice being creative. I just don't want to pass up like, there's a flamingo. Has there been a flamingo before? Does the flamingo mean anything? All right, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. And soccer, thank you very much. She's going to take up soccer just like her mom. All right, focus, focus, soccer balls, music, music, music and soccer balls, music and soccer balls. All right, we're doing good on music. I need more soccer balls. All right, doing good. Oh man, all right. Almost there on music, almost there on music. There's none of soccer balls, even though we specifically spent all of our points. Yes, okay, so we've got music. Music is achieved. Soccer balls needed. I needed one more. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We did it. We did it. 
guys, we did it. Oh my gosh, I am so happy right now. All right, let's keep her healthy. Let's keep her happy. She's got her friends. Let's keep her out of drugs. We're definitely not doing that. All right, she's having a hard time as a streamer, but she's healthy. Okay, should have grabbed that food. All right, we're gonna need to get a little bit of food to get our joy up. She's definitely having a hard time getting a big break, but we're, we finally made it happen. All right, let's be patient. Let's get into our sports. We're not gonna spend, don't waste our money on cars. Why would you bother doing that when you could focus on public transport? Better for the environment, better for our budget. Those things are very complimentary right now. All right, how about this guy with the book? Please, 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 please. Yes! <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, so that seems to be going well, thank goodness. Their relationship is off to a great start. And then I think she really likes what she does. She's gonna just focus on telling the story of her family's history. We're gonna, we're not gonna stay home this time. Because I finally got the job that I was I was questing after. <gasps> Look, it's our kitty cat and our family. She'll definitely be one of those people. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. She would definitely be one of those people. She's so happy with the job she has. Successful. Yes. Avoid the drugs. Oh my gosh. <laughs> This job is amazing! Look, it's us! Oh dear, all right. So we didn't do so great on that one, but that's okay. Check it in on our kid. Seeing how we're doing. Arr! Okay, we at least managed to afford the decent house. I'll take it! <laughs> okay, definitely she did pretty good in a lot of ways. I'm pretty happy for her. And we'll see, I don't know if she had time to really focus on a lot, but look at how happy she was. I really think that she actually ended up being just really content with her days, which is fantastic. All right, let's bond with family as much as possible. It's been a long time since we've had this much happiness for any of our characters. So I'm really happy for Generation 21, they did it. And then we'll see if we have time to bond with a friend or two. Oh, our husband. Well, we're gonna be joining him in just a second. Oh, we almost had perfect happiness. But she was happy and that's what matters. And we we're gonna say that it wasn't a resounding success as we hoped. She's also really poor, but we gave away all of our money uh, at the end of life. And it wasn't as resounding of a success as I hoped. So she could just become world famous with this great story about the 20 previous generations of her family. But she has a buy button on the wall. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. I'm looking up at mine. They're using the new style and mine is the old style. Oh my goodness. All right. That was satisfying. I like the idea that she maybe didn't go big because she didn't sell out and she was just trying really hard to like focus on telling the story she wanted to, which was the story of her family and the amazing, interesting lives they had. I mean, like being a cop through the apocalypse. That was kind of cool when we did that, just saying. There we go. That was fun, guys. I'm glad my people were around me. And we were truly happy, and it was all thanks to you. Your grandchildren are all that keeps you going at such an old age, it seems. My hundred bucks and that guy's hundred bucks, are they worth the same? It was like a dream, finally my own home. I was too nervous, the lecture wasn't great, but at least I got some content out of it. <laughs> oh my gosh, when I was in front of the camera, I was always happy. I was so glad I chose this job. Yeah, she actually seemed to have a great time with this, which is really fantastic. I would have added more plants to her house, personally. And she was very happy. I can say for sure you were the biggest blessing in my life. Thank you for making so many happy memories with me. Aww. I still love you as much as I loved you the day I confessed. So yeah, it wasn't monetary success, but it was definitely a happy success of life. Back then I thought, I don't have any power now, but it'll be successful someday. And maybe she spread that story of her family all over the place. 
<laughs> and that was that was fun. I finally, finally, finally managed to get somebody one of the new jobs, which was awesome. And it was such a great journey. It was it was delightful. It makes me really kind of I know this sounds really silly, but it does make me think a little bit more differently about like what do I want to spend my day doing? Cuz every day we have is a day that will end up building up the story of our lives and the legacy of our lives. And some of the things like not spending a ton of money when you're young on expensive cars really pay off later in life, like being able to have a home that you can really raise your family in if you choose to have that. Like Chips and I are probably going to have a bunch of guinea pigs as our family. Uh, but still, I like how reflective it makes me feel. And so on that note and on that genre, now that we have hit generation 21, boom, we are going to go ahead and we are going to start experimenting with some other games as well that center around the idea of a family legacy. I'm thinking Virtual Villagers 3, or excuse me, Virtual Families 3. I'm thinking a couple other games I found on Steam. If you guys have suggestions, do let me know. We do, of course, have our wonderful Sim series with their ever-expanding legacies as well. So there's going to be a lot more adventures and a lot more ways to kind of explore the concept of life as a game coming up. So thank you guys so much for joining me. If you could, do please leave a like to toss more toys to these little tots, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye!